Trade Genius. Hey guys, how's it going? It's Philip with Trade Genius. All right, this video is called Do As They Do, Not As They Say. And this is more directed to kind of the financial leaders out there in regards to crypto and sentiment. Uh, you'll see a lot of times um, fund managers or even Jamie Dimon, uh, head of JP Morgan, you know, he'll, this chart, this, this graphic here is great because it shows kind of a timeline of all of his negative sentiment about Bitcoin all the way up to about September 12, 2017. And then all of a sudden it starts shooting up and he reverses his stance. And you see that a lot. You know, these guys don't want you to know what they're doing. They want to be buying low and selling high and, and repeating that process. So, you know, now that uh, Bitcoin's taking off, all of a sudden now he's regretted making that comment. Then you fast forward to this month and you got an article from Invest Investopedia JP Morgan dives into crypto space and they've hired a, a young tech star and you know he's going his job is to be diving into crypto strategies uh, you know he's going to be uh, the the basically heading up the fintech program for crypto and he's going to be reporting to Umar Farouk who is the head of blockchain initiatives at the bank so now all of a sudden JP Morgan is all in on crypto so, but it wasn't like they just decided to switch their stance. That's just not the way it works. They they were they were already probably committed to that back in here. It's just that you know they like to. If you're going to get long and you're a bank, you're gonna you're gonna try and get it as cheap as possible. So if you're gonna put you know negative sentiment out there to get, try to keep the price down to accumulate, that's what they're gonna do. That's just what they do. Uh, you know, look at this Tom Lee Funstrat. He's on CNBC quite a bit. And you look at some of his calls, they just, you know, uh, he's he's calling for uh, basically here, misery index shows we're at a bottom. Nope, still going down. Uh, massive outflow of capital be from crypto before tax day. Pretty negative. Then it reverses. Bitcoin will hit 36K by the end of 2019. He actually marked a top right at 10,000 on that comment. Then he was getting very bullish on consensus. We said that there's too many people being bullish for consensus is probably going to roll over, which it did. And there was a start of consensus and it rolls over. So a lot of times, like I don't have a problem with his macro call of 36K by 2019. In fact, I think that's a little bit conservative. But uh, a lot of times these guys will say something and quite often it price on the short term will do the opposite of whatever their sentiment is. Uh, that could be just because retail might rush to put in some orders and all their stops get hit. That could be one factor. But a lot of times when you see these guys come on TV, when they say, oh, this has been doing great, you know, you should get long here. A lot of times the short term move after that is exactly the opposite of what they say to do. So I just want you guys to keep that in mind, especially some of you guys that are newer to the trading space. Uh, this is this is pretty typical. And so I want you to be aware of that. All right, let's take a look real quick at Bitcoin uh, price action. Uh, this is a four hour chart. We broke out of the descending wedge uh, and then we've pulled back and we said we could either hold this level here at about 83.50 or we may come back down and try to retest this trend line, upper trend line of the descending wedge, which we've come down and now we're uh, making a bounce off of. So for me here, I'm looking for this dotted trend line on the four hour chart. This is kind of like where I would say if we break above that, uh, this move here uh, off this off this breakout will resume higher. So break that and come back up here, and I think ultimately uh, get a give this 200-day moving average a test on the four-hour. And that's pretty much it for this video, guys. Uh, thanks for watching. Please hit like and subscribe, and I'll see you on tomorrow's video. Take care. Trade genius.